It's not just the funny faces they make, but many of us are watching the Royal for fashions. It's true. Megan or Kate, oh my gosh, they have the best clothes. When you see them in an outfit, you can bet it's going to sell out in stores. Now, as summer is coming, it's time to take stock on our wardrobes. And my friend is here to give us some help. Fashion blogger Don Parsons, you've got five items to update our summer look. I do. I've got some great pieces, actually. Now, I have to say, I just pulled out some of my summer things, and the purse you told me to get last year... <laughs> It's still fabulous, yes, and yep. I am going to be using it. But awesome. I, I see you have some new bags this year. I did. Okay, so let's start with maybe straw and raffia. That's a fun item to bring okay. into your summer wardrobe. So we're not all buying new summer wardrobes, right? Right, we're just adding a but few But it's always things. fun to add something new. I mean, straw and raffia are the quintessential summer <laughs> material. <laughs> and that can be either, you know, with a shoe or a bag with a fun beaded handle. And who doesn't love a French market tote for the farmer's market? I right? love that. Right? Or yeah. travel. And Absolutely. The yeah. way I travel is just throwing a bunch of things in a bag. So yeah. this would work for me. Definitely. This yep. would work for my big ball of clothing that yes. I usually do. Um, so straw raffia is really fun. Yes. Now, this seems to kind of go with this thing that's so popular, this coastal grandmother vibe that's right. so popular. We had a Hot Topics <laughs> about this. You did. Okay, yeah. I'm all in on that coastal grandmother vibe. So think Nancy Myers movies, Diane Keaton, and, um, you know, all those good movies mm -hmm. that we love, Ina Garten, and just our coastal towns. And I think living here in Seattle, it kind of fits our vibe here. I think it does. Kind of near the water, a little yes. more laid back. So that's lots of linen. Mm -hmm. That's easy. So I've got some linen pieces on the rack oh, over okay. there. Right. Let me allow me to yeah, assist you. Yeah. So I have a fun pink and white striped linen dress from Molly and Bracken. I love so this. So linen does, doesn't have to be white or cream, but you can also bring in, you know, like a fun cream linen trouser. It's so, so soft. Okay, so there's yeah. the linen trouser. And you know what's nice about linen now? It's mixed with cotton, so it's a lot softer than linen from before that used to be kind of scratchy. And it doesn't wrinkle that much. And oh my yeah, gosh, yeah. guess where these pants are from, ladies and gentlemen? I just popped a peek at yeah, the tag. Yeah, you did, right? Target. Target. <laughs> That's where I got my linen pants, too. They're amazing. These are yeah. so cute. They're darling. These are so soft and cute. And do you pair it with this fun little I shirt? I would definitely pair it with that fun little shirt. So that has little glitter lemons on it. That's a Rails linen shirt from Ever Eve, which I love. I've seen your Ever Eve post. Yes, and I, yes, I actually hadn't ever fan. heard of it before um, you. Every we have four stores here in Washington, so very exciting. We have Ooh. lots of great they selections do have there fun every. Stuff. Okay. So linen is really fun, and then you know I'm even my suit today is linen, but I brought in color with linen, which leads us to our next color button-ups. Oh, this is cute. This is from H&M, yes. too. Yes, new favorites for me. I think they're a great way to add color to your wardrobe without maybe doing a print. I'm not an all-over color print girl. Mm -hmm. I would prefer a solid, so I think a color button-up. And it never fails. Every time I wear one of those three shirts, those are actually mine from my closet, <laughs> I get asked about them because I think the color is just so happy and vibrant. And I love these. And from a variety of stores yeah, and places. Yeah. Nordstrom, H&M. And that's great because Zara. when you are trying to, you know, find things that are going to last a little bit but not spend yeah. a fortune. Those are some great options. Exactly, yes. Oh, I yeah. love that yeah. dress. Awesome. is my favorite. I know, it's so cute. Um, so we got the bright button downs, but we also have some brightness here with the, with the shoe department. With the shoe. So some people don't really want to wear color up by their face. Mm -hmm. I'm on social media a lot, and it's very obvious who's a neutral lover and who's a yes. color lover. Yes. And maybe you don't want that color by your face, but how fun to take a pair of white jeans and then add a really fun, colorful shoe. So these are Dolce Vita heels, some Mark Fisher, and then again, another pair of Dolce Vita. These Mark Fisher Little lavender are just beautiful. And they're all very comfortable. I did an event at Every Eve and I wore these for six hours and they're so comfortable. Really? So there's an Ooh, they got a little to foamy to it. Yeah, they're fantastic. I, 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 it's good that you say, I used to actually only buy shoes that were like beige, black, and brown. Yeah, yeah. Because I felt like, well, it has to match something. But right. it doesn't always have to match, right? It no, can be a tonal exactly. issue. I really this wanted to wear those orange shoes today. Might work with my, no? Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I love that idea yes. that you can buy shoes at, that, that don't have to match exactly. No, they don't. It's a fun pop. My grandmother, though, she still says, like, why don't you get a dress, a shoes dyed to match your dress? I don't think they even do that anymore. <laughs> That's kind do of they do that anymore? Thing. I think 
Maybe people do, but probably not a good idea. All right, all right. Well, I see, Don says it. Okay. I say no. <laughs> but speaking of nude, there's always room for a nude. You always need a good nude shoe. It matches everything. Yes. It elongates your leg no matter what. Oh, does it? It does, huh? Yes, because it just blends in. It just flows with whatever ah. you're wearing. So I have some cute ones from this Dolce Vita, actually, both of them. Mm -hmm. Lace up sandals. But then there's also lots of really cute heels with the clear strap, which is what I'm wearing today. You can't see oh, them. Oh, yeah. I'm wearing I see them. Cute They're cute. <laughs> <laughs> Take my word for it. <laughs> so a clear strap, but a nude sandal, a great way to elongate your leg and match whatever. So again, you've brought some great things that we can just add into our wardrobe to make yeah. things fun, but what about our existing wardrobe? How do you go through that and go, okay, this is perfect for this year? This year. When I, I have to put my summer stuff away and pull it back out every year because I don't yeah. have the closet space. I agree I'm with you. So when I do, I try it all back on again because that dress I liked last summer, I might not like on me So this you year. don't just hang it back up, you I try it on. I don't. Shorts okay. have changed. Maybe the length, I want them a little longer. Maybe I want to go a little shorter. I definitely try on all my shorts again oh. and then decide what to keep. Well, good for you for trying on your shirt. <laughs> I will not be trying it's on shorts. It's not my favorite thing to do. Uh, no, it isn't. But you know what? It does get warm sometimes, yeah. God willing. This summer we'll have a nice summer. I know, impressive. Fingers crossed. Yeah. Um, yeah. What about when when going through closet in general? Do you yes. have any great advice? Because I know you've given me some good advice before on kind of how to determine what is a lasting piece and what is something we can say goodbye to. Well, for one thing, the one pieces that you're grabbing all the time, that's what you're most gonna, you're comfortable in and that's what you're gonna wear the most often. Okay. So pay attention to that and then try things on again. That's huge. Yeah. Because if you haven't worn it and you put it on, make sure it goes with some other things in your closet. Can I make a couple outfits out of this piece? Very helpful as well. Awesome. Well, thank yeah. you for giving us so many ideas. Once again, I'm gonna go shopping thanks okay. to you.